hey guys so in today's video i'm going to show you how to fix unable to install app on iphone so if you want to download an app on your iphone but you're getting the error message of enable to install the app let me show you three different things you can do to fix this issue so the first thing might be your network connection so you can just scroll down to your control center turn on your airplay mode and turn it back off so this will refresh your network connection and if you are using Wi-Fi, check your Wi-Fi and make sure the internet is working perfectly. So, another thing you can do is head over to your settings and you need to scroll down and click on General. Once you click on General, click on iPhone Storage. And right here, make sure you have enough storage on your iPhone. So if you don't have enough storage and you try to install a new app, it will not work. So it's going to be showing unable to install app. So if you don't have enough storage, you can just delete those apps that you are no longer using. And you can also delete photos and videos on your iPhone to free up some space. So you cannot retry it again. Another thing you can do is right here in your settings, scroll down and click on screen time. Once you click on it, scroll down again and click on content and privacy restriction. Under content and privacy restriction, make sure it is not turned on. So if it is turned on, there might be a restriction that is not allowing you to download or install new apps. Just turn it off and retry it again. So another thing you can do to fix this issue is make sure there's no VPN enabled on your iPhone. So you can just open your settings, scroll down to general. Under general, scroll down and click on VPN and device management. Once you click on it, click on VPN and make sure no VPN is enabled on your iPhone. So if there's a VPN, just turn it off or click on the information icon in front of it and you're going to say delete VPN. So just remove it and this can also fix this issue. So if it's still not working, another thing you can do is to first restart your iPhone. So to first restart your iPhone, click on the volume up button once, click on the volume down button once and you need to long click on the power button or the side button until you see the Apple logo. So this will not delete anything on your iPhone. It's just going to refresh the RAM memory. So volume up button once, volume down button once, and long click on the power button until you see the Apple logo. Once you see the Apple logo, your phone will now restart. So if you found this video helpful, smash the like button and subscribe.